All right, let's go ahead and take another look at an example of a Venn diagram problem. Now here, I see a Venn diagram of pet owners, fish owners, cat owners, dog owners. And I am asked, it says, strictly on this diagram, which is a valid or true conclusion. Let's look at it. A, what does A say? No cat owners also own dogs. Well, what that's telling me is this bubble here of cat owners must not be sharing any space with dog owners but look i see it right here so yeah some cat owners also own dogs so no nope, that's wrong the next one no dog owners also own fish which means that if i look at the dog owners bubble it better not be touching the bubble of fish owners if i'm looking at it here i see that it does not touch that bubble so that is the right one but let's just go on and look at the other two answers for fun. C, no fish owners also own cats. So what that's saying is what? That fish owners bubble better not be touching the cat owners. But look, it does. Which means this is a false statement. And the last one, no pet owner owns more than one pet. Well, that's just ridiculous because we can see in the diagram all of the bubbles touch at least one other bubble.